Hey guys, so what's up? Today I'm doing another Is It Worth video. Uh, my last one was about my Makeup Geek products. And then today I'm going to do another one about a new product that I own. Um, I had, I've had i had it since like December, but I had a sample size. My cat's hovering. He's trying to get back up. I had a sample size and oh my god, he's just, he's right here. Look, Sylvester. <laughs> so oh my god okay so it's a, a product that I recently have bought full size um, I've had this product since December it was in like a 500 point perk from Sephora and I'm finally finished the little sample and I loved it so much that I had to buy a full size so the product is the Urban Decay Setting Spray. The one that I got in my Point Perk from Sephora was the darker purple one, the All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray. This is the Chill Makeup Setting Spray, but from what I could read on the back, it seemed like the exact same thing. This one seemed a little bit better just because it like cools down your makeup and then it won't move if you like sweat and stuff like that so if you're going out clubbing obviously you're gonna sweat because it's hot in there so I just thought this would be the best one of course I mainly go to like school and work but sometimes if you go out it's just I love using this every single day because it just it helps your makeup stay on your face so this is 30 six or thirty seven dollars which really isn't that expensive i don't think considering how much of it you get you get four full ounces in the little one that i had from sephora i think it was only one ounce and that lasted me for such a long time i got it in december and i just ran out last week um so considering December to September is nine months. I would think that's pretty good. Um, of course, I didn't use it every single day because for a while I kind of forgot I even had it. And then all summer I couldn't wear makeup. So I would say it probably lasted five months, which is still amazing for one ounce. So I'm going to think this will probably last me six months to a year just because it's three times the size. So I definitely think this is a great price point for something of this size. It is very big. You don't need a lot. You spray it like four times max and your makeup will last for hours and it just freshens your face. It makes it look more natural. It's just the best setting spray of my life. I tried the MAC. Fix Plus, but I like this one way more. Um, the MAC Fix Plus kind of had like a weird smell to it. It was too like cucumbery, and I don't know. I just really like this one. Probably because Jaclyn Hill uses it, but I used it before I knew who she was. So, but now I like it more because I know she has it. So that's. But anyways. For sure worth the $36 or $37. Keep in mind, it is Canadian, the price. So if you're American, it will be less money. So even better. It's probably like less than $30, I would think, American. I'm not really sure. Um, some of the things are like a $2 difference. And other things are over $10. So it's hard to gauge how much it would be. But if you are Canadian, this is only $36 or $37, which I think is a really good price point. And it's totally worth it. So you take off the cap and then you take off this one too. You shake it up and you just spray it on your face two to four times. Um, make sure you get like your whole face. You don't want to be soaked. And also you want to make sure that if you're wearing any like liquid eyeliner or mascara that it's dried before you apply the spray because it will make your face wet. And so if you blink, you'll get like the little dots of your eyelashes and it's just not cute. So make sure that your face is completely dry, spray it on, fan your face, and then you're good in like less than a minute and it will keep your makeup on for over 12 hours, which is awesome because if you're working all day long and then you have to go out, you don't have time to freshen up. So this is perfect. Um, you can use it probably to like freshen up during the day if you're starting to get dry, but I 
don't see any separation of makeup before sometimes I would start to like separate my makeup in like my nose and my mouth lines and that doesn't happen at all now that I use this I never realized that a makeup setting spray was like so crucial until I started using it and now I'm like I can't not use it so basically this is amazing everyone needs to buy it and it's just so worth the money the 36 or 37 dollars but yeah so definitely everyone needs to get this and again this is the chill makeup setting spray they have like the de-slick one and the makeup setting all-nighter one and this one i'm pretty sure the all-nighter and the chill are very similar the de-slick i would assume is for oily hence the like slick but i have very dry skin so i didn't even look at that one it was just between the light purple and the dark purple caps um but i read the back and it seemed like they were the same but anyways, it's worth the money for sure, 100%. Go buy it. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this Is It Worth video. If you watch any of my hauls or any other videos and you see products that you would like me to review as an Is It Worth It, please just comment down below, let me know, and I will definitely do that for you guys. I love doing these videos because some products are more expensive and you don't want to waste your money on it. Some people don't have a Sephora close by, so you want to make sure that when you're ordering something from online or going far to drive to the store that you don't have to go back and return it. So that's why I started these videos and this is for sure worth it. But anyways, thank you so much for watching. Keep watching and subscribing. Once I get to 500 subscribers, Alex will do my makeup. And Alex said once I got to 30,000 overall views that I would do his. I have hit that, but we haven't coordinated that yet. But soon that video will be up. So keep subscribing. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And for the millionth time, thank you for watching. Bye.